So today is the day we upload our first AI video to YouTube as I finally managed to edit the entire video together. And I will play you the first 10 to 15 seconds just so you can get an idea as to how it's looking. In America, the student loan debt crisis is looming large over the country's economic landscape with over $1.7 trillion in outstanding student loans. Now, personally, I think it came out pretty good considering I only spent a few hours on it yesterday to have it ready for today. And to recap on the previous video, I've set myself a challenge to dedicate the next 30 days to actually creating a whole new YouTube channel using AI for as much of the process as possible and seeing if we can make any money within that time frame. And so far, I've asked ChatGPT to create my new channel name, which is now Money101. I then tried using Midjourney to actually create the channel logo, but it honestly didn't look that good so I ended up just doing it myself inside of Canva along with the channel banner as well. But after that I then went back to ChatGBT to get a list of YouTube video ideas that we could use. I then finalized on one and then actually asked it again to make it more dramatic and intriguing. And now with a video title I got to work on the script by asking ChatGBT to write me an entire outline for this video and then actually individually asking it to write out the chapters until we had an entire script. Then next I headed over to Murph.ai where I was able to generate an AI voiceover for our video and the last step was to create the video edit by adding in some nice stock footage over the top of our voiceover which leads me to where I'm at now with a new AI video that is ready to go but there are a few more steps that we need to take before the video can be posted. So of course we're trying to grow the channel and make the videos as good as they possibly can be. Also we can make some money from YouTube AdSense and hopefully sponsorships as well. But the issue is we need 1,000 subscribers and a total of 4,000 hours of watch time before we can actually become monetized and start earning money from YouTube AdSense and it's very unlikely we'll get any sponsorships until we reach 50,000 subscribers or more. So before I post this first video, I want to figure out how we can actually start making money from this channel well before we get monetized or start receiving sponsorships. Now, after a while of looking around online, I did discover a few different websites like ClickBank where you can sign up and start promoting affiliate links to a bunch of different products. But I don't think the audience will care for any of these random products, especially if it has no link to the purpose of the video. So I figured why not promote affiliate links to the services that I actually use to create these videos? Because as a viewer watching this AI video on the student debt crisis, I'm not gonna be thinking to myself whether this channel has a link to a 12 week yoga masterclass, but I may be intrigued by the AI voiceover in this video and I may want which website they actually use to generate this voice and the same for the video editing software that I might have used or where I got the background music from and based on the topic of the video we can add in more specific affiliate links that help resolve an issue or get someone started on a service that may have piqued their interest during the video so I think this is where I'm probably going to start off and hopefully we can begin seeing people clicking through in the first 30 days but now let's get down to posting our first video to YouTube and while it's uploading I'm going to head over to mid journey and see if we can generate a thumbnail using AI as well well. And after attempting a few different variations of prompts and layering different images, I think I may just settle on this one for now as it has that dramatic style that I'm looking for. And I think this will work quite well as it's given me some space to work with in the top left where I could put some large and bold text that reads something like student debt, which will obviously capture people's attention before reading the title. So I'm going to hop inside of Canva and get the final touches done for our thumbnail. So this is the final result and I think it looks pretty good. Although my only worry is that it doesn't have that generic look to a thumbnail that most people are used to seeing. So only time will tell if AI is actually any good at getting us a good click through rate. Now, lastly, to finish off our video upload, we're going to need a good description and loads of relevant tags. So for this, I'm going to ask ChatGBT to write a short description for a video title then followed by the looming debt crisis, the dark side of student loans, which has now returned me a nice short and concise description that we can use and hopefully this will help our video rank better in terms of SEO. And now I'm going to do the same again and ask ChatGPT to write a list of keywords that would be associated and most searched for online based on the following video title. And based on what ChatGPT has given us here, I don't think we'll need any more tags than this. So all I'm going to do is just copy and paste these over into YouTube.
Now that we have the video, title, thumbnail, description and tags, our first video for this channel is now live and this officially marks the start of this challenge and the 30 days. And if I'm being completely honest with myself, I definitely did underestimate how long these videos would take to actually produce from start to finish, despite using AI for literally most of the legwork, as most of my time was spent editing the video together and sourcing all the stock footage. So the plan moving forward is to keep editing these videos myself and hopefully get better and better as I keep pumping out more content. But the end goal is to eventually earn enough money from each video to actually justify paying a video editor, which will offload at least 80% of the workload from my hands and put it into the hands of someone who is far better than me. But from a quick look around on Fiverr, it's hard to say how much a video editor will actually cost me because it will depend on the quality that you're looking for. But on the cheap end, I was able to find someone doing it for $20 and this is for a 10 minute video. And then on the high end, someone was looking for around $500. Now, of course, what you pay for is what you get. And I have no idea how long it would take for this channel to actually start earning us enough money to warrant paying a video editor. So this could be weeks or months, only time will tell. Okay, it's now the following day and I did finish this video off with an outro and everything, but I've just had an idea as to how we can actually grow this channel that little bit faster. And this is by posting shorts videos. Because while our main videos will be the bulk of the content posted to our channel, I think shorts videos can actually help us attract new subscribers who are also interested in the niche of business and finance, which will then hopefully convert them into long-term viewers of our main videos. And the way we're going to create our new shorts videos will be the exact same way as we do with our main videos, but we are going to need one more piece of AI to help us. Because I'm sure you've seen by now that most shorts, TikToks and Reels all have captions and this is so people can watch the video without any sound on or just to generally clarify what was being said as they are typically so fast paced. And to replicate the same thing, we're going to be using a speech to text AI tool that is inside of Premiere Pro, which will allow us to take any voiceover and immediately turn it into automatic captions, which will appear over the video as the words are being said. The process of how I'm going to create these shorts videos using AI is again heading over to ChatGBT to generate the script. So here I'm going to ask it to write a YouTube script for the following and then I've decided to put the rise to fame of Richard Branson. And now that it's returned me that script, I've just been through and selected all the important lines and chapters that I want to use, copied and pasted it into a Word document where I'm now actually going to copy and paste it back into ChatGBT where I'm going to ask it to make it shorter and below 120 words. Then next I'm going to take this shortened script, copy and paste it back into our Word document and then copy and paste it over into Murph.ai where we can go ahead and generate the voiceover. And being that shorts are typically faster paced and not so dramatic like our main videos, I'm going to change the voice from our man Hugh and change it to the new guy Mike. And after spending just a few minutes going over each line and making sure that everything is being pronounced correctly, I'm now going to export the audio and take it over to Premiere Pro. And again, I've just quickly thrown on some audio effects to the voiceover just to make it sound more powerful and less like AI. But now to get captions auto generated, I'm going to click on our audio then head to the text section and then click create transcription and then just let AI do its thing. Now with our transcript, we can go ahead and generate the captions. And we can also adjust the settings to display just a few words at a time to match the fast paced theme of the shorts videos. But now for the longest part, which is just gathering all the visual content and just editing the video together. Now here we have our first shorts video. This man is a renowned entrepreneur with a net worth of over $5 billion. He founded Virgin Records in the early 1970s, which led to the creation of his business empire. And I don't think I'll need to show you the process to uploading this shorts video to YouTube as it's pretty much the same as earlier on in this video, but just without a thumbnail. So. Over the next week or so, I'm just going to be hammering out new main videos and shorts videos as well. And I'm hoping the next time I speak to you guys, I'll bring good news. But if I don't, I'll let you know of any progress that has been made anyway, or if any changes have been made to this challenge. So that is going to wrap up this video. I will see you guys in the next one. Take care and bye for now. Peace.